Gateway Bible Church, how is it going? I'm Dan. I want to give you an update. What's going on with our Global Impact Team? As you know, I've been overseeing the youth for quite a while right now, but I'm stepping back in and I'm overseeing our global partners. And uh, there's a couple partners that I want to bring to your attention. And one of them is Oscar James. Oscar James is our partner from West Africa. And he was supposed to be there right now, back on the ground, discipling and training his pastors and reaching out to the ministry, see what he could do there. And uh, if you haven't heard, Ebola has once again broken out in the West Africa area again. So they have shut down the borders and Oscar James cannot go. And so be praying for that situation. Oscar really wants to get out there and he's going to probably in about another four to six weeks. He's got to let this pass and let the, uh, the country control what's happening right now. But I remember him saying last time when Ebola broke out there like eight years ago, he said, a tremendous move of God happened as a result of all this. And he says, I know that God is in control. Good things are still happening in Liberia. And he's going to be here next month to share some of those stories with you. And then I got another global partner. His name is Mitch Anderson. He's our partner from Chile. Man, this guy is always on a wild ride, man. I love Mitch. He is just full of life. He loves what he's doing. I'm excited. And I know this church is excited about what he does there as well. And if in case you didn't know, he just had a valve replacement and a triple bypass surgery. And everything went great. But then like hours later, it's like his, uh, his valve burst and he was bleeding into his body cavity. He had to get rushed into surgery once again and get that all fixed up. Needless to say, he says, I have never gone through something like this before. And he has gone through a lot. So let's be putting our prayers out for Mitch and his family because this is a hard road of recovery with stuff like that happening. And uh, he would really welcome your prayers. And then we love Natalie and Pierre, our global partners from Haiti. And uh, they're saying right now, they are just in a season where they're just discouraged and they want to start over with the training and the discipling of like new leaders on the ground. They had to let some of their leaders go so they feel like they're in a revamp and a renewal mode right now. So let's pray that they're encouraged and all these other great things that's going on that we just pray for them. And in the meanwhile, there are still hundreds of kids that are coming every week to their campus. Why? Because they're so excited to be there to worship God and hear about the good news. And so let's remember to pray for those guys. Let's pray for Oscar James in Liberia. West Africa. Let's pray for Mitch in Chile, Mitch Anderson, and then pray for uh, Natalie and Pierre, our partners in Haiti.